Hey everyone, this is me, Sadia here, and I'm back with the first week of uh, December read stuff from the 1st through the 7th of December 2023. This reading is going to be for the sign of Taurus. So Taurus, let's see what's coming in for you for this uh, week time. I will be adding a lot many cards here in this reading, so stay tuned. And before I dive into the read, let me remind you, it is a general reading. It may not, may not resonate with everyone out there. Pick whatever resonates and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can also check out other services that I offer as well in the description box. So let's see what's coming in for you, Taurus, for the first week of December time. Wow. Four of Wands, King of Wands, and Page of Swords. Underneath the deck, we do have Nine of Swords. Wow. I feel like, you know... um. I really see an opportunity where um, I really see you having an opportunity to either reconcile with a specific someone in this uh, first week time or a justice is going to be served in your love life in some ways. I really feel like you know there is a specific someone or there has been a specific someone that you always wanted to be a part of, you know, um, you know, each other's life, somebody that you wanted to stick around. Um, you always wanted this person. You always desired to have a happily ever after with this person. Um, I really feel like, you know, that specific someone is looking at you or seeing you from that perspective that you used to have towards this connection. And it was never the case for them before. I feel like, you know, they never saw you as they're the one. But now in this week time, somehow this person is seeing you as their um you know future uh spouse or something that they would like to kind of like you know take this connection next level with uh this person can be somebody that you have been dealing with and you are still dealing with somebody who was very non-committal very uh fun to be with very happy to you know happy kind of a happy good lucky kind of a person or somebody but they were always running away from commitment and you know giving you the love that you always wanted to have in your life uh, you know, being expressive, being protective, being loyal, being like, you know, there for you. I feel like you know, they were always resisting that um, uh, need to be emotionally available to you. I feel like, you know, they were holding themselves back purposely. They were like, you know, restricting themselves to be available to you. But I really feel like, you know, in the um, first week of December here, I really see things changing. I really see this person uh, looking at you from that perspective where they are kind of like you know, giving giving it a thought you know we can be like the perfect couple there so i really see some sort of justice gonna come for you in your love life with the with the specific someone now for those of you who are completely single and you always wanted to get married or have a happy home life you wanted your love life to move forward i really see somebody maybe from the past is going to come through or somebody new is going to come for you with that intention to get married to you now the only thing that i see you confused with is shall you move on or shall you wait for somebody from the past i feel like you know whatever offer that is coming your way in the first week of december you should accept that as a divine blessing and move forward with your life don't waste your time thinking oh my god the past person is going to return or this or that the offer that i see here coming for you is very beautiful is very satisfying is very emotionally available somebody is willing to get you know married to you have a life with you after that now i really feel like you know the divine is bringing you forward this offer this opportunity uh where you know there is a person coming in your life who loves you who values you and who's ready to take things forward with you don't hold yourself back just move on with that offer and take this offer with full gratitude and move ahead with your life i feel like you know for majority of you um especially if you are completely single or you know at least that's how you see yourself but deep down you're still waiting on for a past person yes this might be a past person returning but it can be a new offer too um which is going to be filled with so much love and um abundance so make sure that you take this offer and move ahead in your life uh don't hold yourself back for somebody from the you know from the past to return or with the hopes of that even so let's see what else is coming in for you for this week time a situation that has been troubling you has come to an end and you can breathe a sigh of relief with the challenging times behind you you can now move on it's important to fully let go at this juncture 
someone in your life may now finally be free of his or her addictions or codependency issues I feel like you know, if you have been having those codependency issues or addiction towards a specific someone, now you're free from that. It's time for you to move forward. It's time for you to move ahead in your life. Accept the beautiful offer that is coming your way and move forward with your life in, a, in the most beautiful way. Um, so, yeah, let's see. Um, let's add some more divine messages. Let's see what it has to add. <clears throat> New psychic and spiritual experiences are changing the way you view the world and yourself. Allow your spiritual gifts to open through study, prayer, and meditations. I really feel like you know, it's going to be a very, very beautiful kind of a time frame of your life because I really see you more aligned uh, to, to the divine blessings, um, more aligned to the right path, which is taking you closer to your goals, desires, and wishes and dreams. Now, I really feel like you know, for the majority of you, you already might be experiencing some psychic, uh, you know, um, experiences like, you know, where you're picking up signs and messages and you're feeling very spiritual or very much uplifted or positive and at peace from within. I feel like you know, it's very important right now for you to allow yourself to be at peace. Don't try to kind of like, you know, think about the past and keep yourself in a, in a you know, um, in a... Um, confusion or any sort of like you know um burden uh that that can bog you down right now just let it all go just uh, uplift yourself from the situation and you know just feel the blessing coming your way don't let the past hold you back in any possible way and um study um meditate um you know pray around whatever it is that you want and how can you have it how can you achieve it use affirmations do that um you know search online what are the things that can bring you closer to your uh you know to, to your uh genuine being which is like a spiritual being and you are one spiritual being who can have what you desire by just thinking the right set of thoughts and i feel like you know you are becoming a better version of you every every passing day uh the divine really want you to just receive the blessings that are coming your way. Don't hold yourself back. Don't let your past hold you back from, you know, having the abundance that I see coming for you. So that's exactly what you need to be doing right now. And I feel like in you know, a majority of you, the, the offer that I see coming is the result of you having changed yourself. So just open your arms up to receive this blessing. And I feel like, you know, there is a, I don't know, I really see you walking away, getting married to someone and feeling very happy and fulfilled uh, with this offer. It's it's amazing. This offer is going to be very fulfilling. And I feel like, you know, for majority of you, probably it's a new person uh, that you're moving on with. Uh, because I really see you still looking backward as you walk away with this person, especially with this card here. If you could look closely, you know, you're moving forward, but then you're looking backward. Uh, just move on it's it's a new life that you're starting to live now and just go ahead with it and don't look back now and the rest is going to be awesome so yeah that's uh, pretty much it coming up for you for this uh, week time if it was of help to like share and subscribe till i do the next read take care bye